Okay, this is my videos on an Altoids survival team. Uh, there's pretty much everything you would need to survive for a few days. So this is a basic opening. Oops, the little roll of duct tape just fell out. That's three feet of duct tape, if you guys are wondering. I'll just put that inside. Oh, and there's still space inside for extra stuff. You guys can put whatever you guys want in there. This is just a basic setup. Uh, right here, I have an M4 uh, saber tool. You can find them on Amazon. They're like $16. It has pliers on it. There's a set of pliers. And then there's a flathead screwdriver, a Phillips screwdriver, and then a knife blade on the side. And all these things are locking, they all lock. You just have like a push a little tab and it'll be unlocked. On this side there's a file, a little screwdriver along with a can opener, or bottle opener I mean, and then a pair of tweezers, little thin tweezers, you can see. But yeah, so that's the multi-tool for this, very useful. And then inside of it, I have from a previous video this miniature Altoids tin, but there is a difference on it. I took the sandwich baggie out and put it in the large container, and then on the inside of this one, since I have more space, since I took the sandwich baggie out, I put some Tums, a couple of Advil, and a Leave Liquid Gel, having a little medication on you. I also put there instead of the sandwich baggie, it was three feet of steel wire. It's strong, just picture frame wire. It's nothing like extremely special. But and I'll, I'll post a link to my little Altoids tin video so you guys can check what everything that's in that one. Also in here, hold on, put that over there. Is just over three and a half feet of nylon cord. It's a hundred pound nylon cord, it's thin. And so I would put uh, the what is it quarter or eighth inch parachute cord, but that's just too thick. Uh, then I have a birthday candle, and this is a uh, what is it the Dollar Tree? It's I don't know twenty in a package, I think it is. And if you guys do put one of these in there. I haven't done it yet, but each inch on here will burn about 12 minutes. I timed it myself. So if you guys want, when you put your candle in there, mark it for how much time so you know exactly how long it's burned. I have half Q-tip in here, and that goes along with uh, this Neosporin that is in here. Tiny little Neosporin cuts and all that. It's about a uh, I have an alcohol prep pad. Uh, I have two and a half feet of aluminum foil. Uh, you guys can look up the on how to fold it into a little container to boil water in. Or ah, she posted a little link on here on the side for you guys. I have one large band aid. I have. Three strike on the uh, strike on the box matches, and I do not have the striker in this large container, but I do have a striker on the small thing or the ten matches I have that are in the Altoid small, so that's fine. And then I have three uh, butterfly bandages, strong and sturdy bandages. I have four pieces of lined paper in there. You burn it, write on it, whatever. And then I decide just to keep the uh, paper that came with the Altoids in there. It's extra stuff to burn. Burns well. And then uh, instead of most people will put in their kit a whistle, but I put this little piece of plastic, and there's a reason for it. Because you can make a makeshift whistle out of a thin piece of plastic. All you have to do is fold it like this, two fingers. Pull it slightly tight and then blow on it. Yeah, it's a pretty loud whistle. And 
that is it. You guys can subscribe and comment below, and I will post a list of every single item that is in this kit in the description. Thank you guys for watching.